Uh, we take them to the prison reform, the Elmira Prison. I think that's what it's called, yeah. On the hill, Elmira Prison. The reformatory clubhouse out back has open land and they have an agreement with us that we can dump them out there. We flatten them out. We push them over a bank. So it actually, instead of the bank going like this and being a danger, it smooths the bank out more. Uh, it's mainly a benefit to the public because um, if not, I could just see them all over the street. And if we didn't, when the snow plows come through, it'd push it back into the front yards, uh, clogs catch basins. If they just left them out in the street or the wind blows, it's gonna clog catch basins. It creates danger with traffic, big old piles, of traffic trying to get through, they might get hit head on, stuff like that. And catch basins, uh, I assume. Catch are... basins are the metal grates on the side of the road where the water drains into. Okay. So if they're just covered with leaves, your streets are gonna eventually flood. The main thing that I would you know, tell people to do is if they can bag them or put them in like a trailer, they can take them up the Bolstein Road. It's the county north DPW like this is. It's behind your old, old Kmart Plaza on Shimong Street. It's called Bolstein Road. They take them in there, they dump them. They don't have to wait for us to come pick them up. So they're done with them. I mean, if they drop again, some more are gonna drop, they can take them back up there again. And there's actually free mulch after we grind everything up there, they can take free mulch back home. We're starting November 2nd, ending, you know, middle of December, but try to get them out a week ahead of November 2nd, because if we go down a street at seven o'clock in the morning, this person comes and rakes them out at 10 o'clock in the morning, they're gonna sit there for probably a good two weeks till we get back around. We do Either or, let's say, so as we're right here, this is our building, Sullivan Street, you came in on Linden. Yep. So we're right here. Let's say we go out and we start on Linden Place or Carpenter. That's only gonna take us 10 minutes. A loader's coming by, picking up, putting in the truck. These guys decide to go out at 10 in the morning. They rake their leaves. We gotta do this whole section, this whole section, and then we come back and restart. So that could be two to three weeks sitting there. They're gonna make phone calls. It's actually probably gonna kill the grass because if they put it in the right of way. So, and then they'll just be like, hey, are you guys coming back by? Yes, we do. We do it at least a minimum of twice. If we can get three times in, but you gotta figure if it snows late November, December, we're not picking up leaves, we're plowing. So then we go back after the snow's melted and we start doing leaves again. Yep. So it's, it's, it's not a huge, huge, huge deal because it's just leaves, but they need to be picked up or else it'll cause hazards down the road. So I would say, I would announce, uh, you can start putting them out. I even know people have already put them out, that's a good thing, but we don't wipe them out too early. I would say start putting them out the Monday before buddy um the 26. 26 yeah that'd be the best because that way everybody can have them out we go through they fall some more and they can put them out again yep all right